continues. A dog in desperate need of care found abandoned in the cold on Sunday night. As CTV's Carmen Wong tells us, he was taken in by a kennel where they say they're, they have been seeing a concerning trend of dogs being dumped. <laughs> Diesel was found abandoned just outside of Waterford Sunday night. Taken in by hillside kennels, malnourished, dehydrated, and with frostbite on his ears, nose, and cheeks. He's really sweet, but he's scared, right? Because this has been obviously traumatic for him. Diesel is one of the most recent cases of dogs that appears to have been dumped in the Brant, Norfolk, and Oxford County areas. A trend Hillside Kennels Animal Control Officer Cassia Bryden says is concerning. I'm finding at least one dog a weekend is coming in in a a not good state, you know, thin, matted, um, stained with urine, long nails. Hillside Kennels Coner says they provide animal control and have helped about 20 dogs over the last couple of months. They say more than 100 were also surrendered into their care. We had two Dobermans that were dumped, skinny, skinny, skinny. We had the three little dogs that were dumped out in Paris. We had two Rottweilers that we picked up and then another Rottweiler that was hit by a car and killed that we picked up. Gibson says these dogs were likely purchased during the pandemic and the responsibility cost of care may have been too much for the owner. And the dog starts being destructive because they just are used to the people being home and then all of a sudden they're gone or they get them out and they walk them more and they're going at people or going at other dogs. CTV News reached out to the OSPCA but did not hear back before airtime. The kennel urging anyone no longer capable of supporting their pet to reach out for support. The shelters everywhere right now are full and we really do need to um, to focus on the dogs that are falling through the cracks in Ontario. <laughs> As for Diesel, the kennel says the person who first spotted him out in the cold is interested in giving him a warm forever home. Carmen Wong, CTV News, Interkip. For the second day in a row.